Yo, what's up, YouTube? We are back on the Madden 16. Today, we got an Easter promo. Some Easter goodies. Let's check this bad boy out, man. First up, the biggest set, the bitch a bang a bang. We got an Easter dick lane, man. So this means no boss dick lane, no 99 dick lane. So if you want to build your dick lane squadron, it's only going to be two dick lanes in the game. Now, what all goes in this set pretty much encompasses this promo, man. We got some gold players, got some elite players, got some elite eggs, and got some gold eggs. Now, gold eggs, elite eggs. These things are super cheap. When the set first dropped, there was a glitch, so these things are going for the low low right now. Now, elite players, these things are going for a ton. First up, Simi Watkins, 97 overall. None on the option block earlier, going for 700k. Insanely priced card. No, not 700k, 1.5 million thousand coins. Zach Ryan going for 500,000 coins, and it's not off stats, it's just, yo, dudes want that dick lane, man. 98 pass block, 93 run block, 86 excel. And 73 speed, Zach Martin looking dope. I think right now these Easter elites are super rare too, man. It's, it's not a Bobby Wagner up right now. It's not a Simi Watkins up right now. And this is in the evening too, man. Dudes have definitely been pulling packs. See what else he got. Anybody else worth checking out, man? Alex Smith. He's not worth checking out. Marcel Reese fullback. Marcel Reese cards going for 800,000 fucking coins. This promo is ridiculous. Dick, Dick Lane is just, it's just insane to get him, man. It's fucking insane. Check his stats out. 92 speed. 83 run block, 92 catch, 88 stiff form, 98 carry, and 92 trucking. This promo's kind of weird, man. Let's say your favorite player got in your car. You probably won't be able to afford it, man. Zach Martin, 500k. Wagner not even up. Penalty not even up. You're lucky to even find your favorite player up on auction block. Let's see what the golds are going for. Do these golds go for anything? I think go the golds aren't even up either. Yo, the pull rates on this promo is stupid right now. All right, this girl's going for the Lolo, but, but but we just saw Demarcus Lawrence not even up. Kind of crazy, kind of kind of crazy. Now guys, I doubt we find a dick lane on the auction block since the cards that go to this promo are just so freaking rare, man. Let's see if we can find one. We found one, baby, dick lane going for five million coins. Car looks sick, dick lane in color, something you don't see a lot in my car looks sick. I like the little Easter theme to it. Dope ass looking card, stat wise. 96 speed, 100 zone, 101 hit power, 98 play rec. Oh, looking nasty. 95 tackle, 97 pursuit, 92 man, 96 excel. Stats definitely look freaking filthy. But this car just looked impossible to get. I wish I could compare it to the other dick lane. I don't know why they don't just let you compare defensive backs to defensive backs and just leave it two positions. That's kind of stupid. But dick lane definitely look it. I mean, if you're only rocking strong safeties, I think the other best strong safeties are what? They position here over Rashad Jones. He's not even that good. Stick lane definitely the best strong safety in the game, but five million coins, one million coins, goddamn! That is a lot of coinage for a strong safety. Now guys, of course, since we got a new promo, we do have some new packs. Easter packs, 14 pack bundle, gives you 14 Easter packs and one guaranteed elite Easter player and an Easter egg collectible. Now, once again, those eggs, damn, they're worthless right now. And then the four pack bundle gives you three gold bitter players as the topper. I'm not touching these packs, yo. We just saw nothing is coming out of them by the looks of things. So I'm gonna get some loose Easter packs. I'm gonna get some of the coins, maybe one of the points, see what our luck is like. And then I might revisit those bundles later, man. I don't know. I'm not sure how long this promo is gonna last or what's the best way to finesse it. Leo Collins or Jamie Collins, better yet. That's not that bad. Two eggs in this one too. That's not that bad. Next up, got a Pierre Thomas, Alfred Mars, Brandon Boykin, Unpainted Egg. I'm gonna show you what you can do with these collectibles too. And these eggs, ooh, Bitter Lemon. Got an elite egg. You would think elite eggs are dope ass pools, but they're, they're, they're so not dope pools. Like the players go for so much in like the big sets, like like that big dick lane set that nobody, nobody really cares about the elite eggs anymore. It's kind of crazy. Final Easter pack. See how I can clutch on an elite? We got a Nick Fairley. Nick Fairley, where's he going? Patriots going to the Saints. Who knows? I know he was in the NO. I know he visited the Patriots. Be interesting to see where he lands. Yo, Cowboys side Alfred Morris. Comments, let me know what y'all think about it, man. I promise, if the Patriots would've got Alfred Morris, Twitter would've went nuts. The Cowboys had Alfred Morris for two years, three mil, insanely friendly deal for the Cowboys. But Twitter was like, oh, he's washed. Oh, he's trash. Oh, his numbers go down each year. Like, to me, to me it's a fire-ass pool, man. I thought it was a great pool or a fucking signing. I'm so, I'm so, I'm so mutt-washed. I thought it was a dope-ass signing for the boys to get Alfred Morris. And I thought it was dope. Now, of course, I'm being optimistic, and I want things to work out, but I think he's going to be a great zone running back. It's just like when, when we signed Run DMC, and everyone's like, oh, he's fragile. Oh, he's going to get injured. 
Oh, he won't even make it through the preseason. Dude was a top five back this year. Now, every time I say that, people say, well, Berg, some top backs got injured. The name of the game is stay healthy, baby. That's the name of the game in the football. Stay healthy. So he was a top five back last year, man. Can't take that away from him. And he didn't even get the workload until like four or five weeks into the season. Now, back to the mud. I think the best way to go about this promo is, I guess, maybe, maybe just go fishing in this Elite Easter player set, man. That's what I'm going to do. We're gonna see how it goes. I've already bought the things I needed off the auction block. Now, now I will say this. If, if you're going to be buying stuff off the auction block, definitely surf, sort by team. I said sort. Definitely sort by team and stuff because right now everybody's just chucking stuff up on the auction block. And if you don't filter it down enough, you're going to be overpaying for stuff. Let's say gold players. If you don't filter your gold players, at least by team, instead of playing 8k per gold player, you might pay something like 12 or 15k per, per gold player. And by like 10 gold players, it's going to be a solid chunk of coins. So I guess just, just do that if you're going to be knocking out this set. All right, guys, we are done. With this set, Elite Player Reward Pack. Hopefully, we can get a Sammy Watkins, maybe a Zach Martin. I feel like every Elite is coins. I feel like every Elite is freaking coins. This set isn't that expensive to do. So let's do it, Elite Player Reward Pack. Let's see what's inside this bad boy, baby. And we got a Melvin Ingram, 92 overall. Let's see what he's going for, man. First, let's check his stats out. Shout out to the Chargers fans. 90 speed, 88 tackle, 85 block shit, 91 play rank, 91 hit power, and 88 strength. Okay. Melvin Ingram. If I can get 100k out of him, I'm cool. I'm happy. I'm chilling. Melvin Ingram going for a whopping 30,000 coins. Damn it, yo. That was kind of a... That was kind of... On, on another note, that set was super easy to do. So I think I might give it another run through. And see if we can get lucky. That said, what wasn't that hard to do. It really wasn't that hard to do, man. All right, guys. Pack number two. Elite play reward pack. Let's see what's in this bad boy. Hopefully, we get that Sammy Watkins, babe. Give me a big pull. Oh, shit. God damn. We got a Jabal Sheer. I didn't even know that it was pulls this bad in this. Whoa. All right. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm sure this is probably going for 20K. I will see you guys in the next one more gameplay dropping tomorrow. Take it easy. Peace.